So guys, we only have about five or six more episodes because from what I saw online, we're only at core one of Hell's Paradise. And core two or the second half of this show, we don't know when it's going to come out. My predictions and don't go off about off what I'm saying. I guess it might show during the fall season. So it'll be absent during the summer season and then make another reappearance. If either not fall, then winter of 2023 to 2024. But that's just my prediction based on what I saw on social media, aka Twitter. Okay. Uh don't don't just take it with a grain of salt. Um but yeah, so this first half of, of, of Hell's Paradise, we're almost done with it. And it's episode every episode is just getting crazy and crazy because last week obviously none of us expected we didn't expect that like what two women kissing or anything i i did not and from what they were telling us there are inhabited inhabitants or spirits or of that case that live on the island almost like if as if they're gods right so my question is are those two people that we saw those inhabitants you know and what's going to happen to the brothers now since they you know accidentally caught them in action okay so guys let's get into hell's paradise episode seven really and then they looked at them Why are humans here? Mm. They're not human, that's the thing. They said, come fool with us, what? So they're kind of far into the Ooh. Oh, we change into a male. Oh. Oh yeah, the hermits and happens. Oh uh, yeah, they found the hermits, all right. Oh, there's another one with pink hair. Flowers and offerings. There is someone behind y'all. Oh, he finally knows. Oh. It looks like a little, oh, the little kid in the opening. Oh. Nah, that's a group. True. Wow. Y'all handle group. I'll go get the little girl. Y'all gotta deal with Groot now. Did she just steal his glasses? Why? What is this? What? 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 What is that coming off of her? What? Oh, she's nipple. Oh, he got. <laughs> uh. Oh, she got strained. 
Well, then again, she's an inhabited, so of course. Oh, no, she come in with a gong punch. Oh, no. <laughs> he blocked out. Wow. Oh, wow. Whoa. But she looks so adorable. You're not going to hurt a little kid. Ooh. Is he going to tie her up? Oh, uh, yeah, he's going to tie her up. Yeah, he wants to get to his wife. No, he ain't going to stop this man. Oh, no, you made her cry. You made her cry, Gabi Maru. Yes, yes, yes. Mama Sakri is here to calm the child. <laughs> Oh no, they beat group. And they looking all at Sakri. Oh, he protects a child. Mm -hmm. the, I mean, a bat. Yeah, I, I've been on this island for two days. I need a bat. <laughs> Yo, screw food. I need to be clean. But yeah, oh, that's the place where the brothers um first stumble upon. It wasn't like that for a thousand, thousand years ago. Oh wow! So people really did live on this island, probably, again, mystical type of people. A bath verse. So they just lived and work on keeping the place fit. Nah, <laughs> that bath water is too good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It feels amazing. Oh, at least she's one of the friendly inhabitants.
I don't think they're gonna hurt you guys. Nah, just eat, bro. Just eat. I don't think they're going to hurt you. Oh, God. His mouth is watering. Okay, so the inhabitants call the island Kotaku. Oh, where the gods live. Also, the elixir does exist. In the legend, we call it ten. Oh. So which region there? Mm hmm. So the village there and it's called Hojo. So it's in the inner part. In the center of the island. Oh, okay. Yeah. So they're actually pretty close to the like to Tan. I wonder if he's talking about those two women. <gasps> oh, he chopped it. Oh, that's the same thing that um the the village chief head was able of doing from Gabimaru's village, and they drank ten. Ooh. He broke the axe. Oh, they're called Tensin. Don't tell me that they don't allow anyone to leave. I feel neither affection nor animosity. Oh. They dropped them in a well? They command this ocean and punish it. So they're the one. Oh, so they're the ones that command all those monsters. Not him. Oh, he's not dead. Simply don't die. He dropped him in the well with all those living people. Oh no! No, don't kill the brothers now. Lives have been transformed into flowers become the source of tan. Where is she? 
No, don't go hurting the little girl. Yeah, don't go pointing at the little girl. Mmm. Mmm, so they're dropping a whole lot of lore in this episode. I like that. <laughs> she was nodding off. <laughs> <laughs> you were nodding off, Sadi. By the tension, okay. So that means the brothers were actually close to the elixir until they got beat up by them. Oko, and the little girl's name May. I mean, no, they exist. She was taking about to take a bath. And she's a little girl who got me for her. Yeah, this is different. She has a little scar. Oh no. Right. Because he's, you know, the what guy is. Oh, she's going to beat me. And because she's a little girl, she don't got no parent and nobody to really teach her how to, you know, proper hygiene. Oh, oh that, that's Sagri's daughter. That's her daughter now. <laughs> May is her daughter. <laughs> No, you need proper hygiene, my boy. Oh, wow.
his wife just speaks wisdom to him like for a guy that was a bloodlusting killer his wife is just like you know just live <laughs> have fun live She's the strategist, but he, he's a general, but I'm the strategist. Ah, I like that. I like that. No, get in the water, my boy. And he tells her, don't hide your scar. You don't have to do that. I want him to be reunited with his wife. She's so beautiful. Oh my god. <laughs> even even Sakura is just like, bro, that touched my heart. <laughs> oh, she's beginning to like you. Oh, Miss like you. She's like you got the mom. Dang, why the episode gotta end like that, man? Okay, so like I was saying in the reaction, this was a very informative episode. They explained a lot, especially about the island, because ever since the first episode up until this point, the island remained mysterious to all of us. Nile told us that these immortal beings who had at least a taste of the elixir of life or known as Tan are known as the Tensin. So basically they govern over all the monsters that you see on the island. The monsters are meant to protect anyone that trespasses on the island. If they reach further enough, far into the island, they broke down how each there's like three uh, posts, if you will. There's three sections of the of the island itself, and from what we know, um, Gabi Maru and everyone is very close to the ten. They're in like the middle section of the island. I forgot the name real quick. Um, Horai, I believe, they're very close to where the Elixir of Life, also known as Ten, is. Okay, so they met the Tensei, of course, one of them being the, looking like she's the youngest, the physical child, uh, May, and who's being raised and cared for for a thousand years by um, Hoko, or like I want to say, the anime version of Groot. Instead of saying he is I am Groot, he speaks in full sentences, right? And the other two Tensen beings who it looks like they can, you know, change change their gender, their sex at will. Um, they defeated the brothers and then threw them down in the well with other still living human beings that somehow made it onto the island as well. So their job, the Tensin, is to the warp any trespassers, especially humans, from coming in. And if they manage to get further enough into the island, they turn into basically the prettier version of The Last of Us, okay? Without the fungus, they turn into living flowers, okay? And then they never leave, right? 
So that's their whole point of being on that island. Like they protect, they're protecting their home. They're protecting them home from anybody that wants to go there and do whatever they want with the island. And the fact that these, these beings can't die, uh, you're kind of screwed, okay? So they got this information. They managed to get a bat. Unfortunately for the brothers, they're, you know, hopefully they don't die, okay? But this gives um, more meaning into what's going on because this goes to show like the mystery of the island and them getting a better understanding. And I don't think um, Hoko was lying. I don't think he was. Because given the fact that he's in the part of the village where it's deserted, meaning there was probably more like him and May and the other two on the village, on, on the island and possibly the reason why they're so hostile and this is just my guess it's because they have humans and other people come onto the island and damage their homes or then again it's been a thousand years so people that don't live there the place starts to deteriorate and all that stuff but that's just my guess probably trespass trespassers have come onto the island and hurt them damage their place and also because of the elixir of life this also makes me think Especially with Gabimaru and then you know the village he's affiliated with how they're trying to come to the island and but his chief His chief can't die. He had the elixir of life So my now I got this theory thinking possibly Oh shit, bro. I'm bro <laughs> possibly Why they have such distrust people like Gabimaru's chief really came onto the island looking looking for the elixir of life and really mess things up for their own greed. And now they're coming back again. So they have to get to the elixir of life or tan first before people like Gabimaru's chief comes back again and do whatever they, and especially because he can't die either. So uh, I, I do have questions, but I'm glad that this was more of like an information dump episode that tells us a lot that's going on. So we know what we're getting really getting into going forward with the remaining episodes. So guys, don't mind that. So guys, do tell me in the comment section below on how you felt about this week's episode of Hell's Paradise episode 7. What were some things you were able to take away from? What are your predictions as to why the Tencent, other than May, are so hostile? And do you think it has to do with, you know, trespassers, people coming onto the island and, and damaging it? Or is it for another reason? If if it's stuff that's leading to the manga that hasn't appeared in the anime, of course, no spoilers. The links are in the description box. You guys go check that out. And I'm Kimmy Channel, but I'm Anime Legends. And I will see you guys later. Bye!